Yo, what up guys, your boy Deacon Nice, we're back here on another video. Now, today, I was gonna do a cover 2 beater, shout out to AKG, uh, but he literally thought of the same, cause that, uh, not beater, but uh, money play, that concept isn't like, it's not foreign, but you know, we like to shed light on certain things, cause we know a lot of things, but you guys may not, uh, so if you guys haven't, uh, don't or or haven't already go check out AKG. Make sure you sub to him and make sure you check out that that cover two money play uh, that he posted for you guys. Uh, but I'm gonna be going over uh, split close defense. That's a very really popular formation between bunch tight slots. Um, those are some of the more popular formations. Uh, so I'm gonna be going over how to lock up a uh, bunch out of our blitz. So you y'all know by now. I don't know by now. Uh, linebacker cross uh, three show two, and so there's you know a few plays when people come out and split close, right? So we're we're in um Cardinals playbook. Cardinals playbook, obviously. Yeah. All right. Shut up. Shut up. Okay. Um, they got PA slide that a lot of people like to run. They got wide receiver corner, which is similar to. A close HB wheel or H whatever that that particular playbook calls it. So between that, the power and PA slide, maybe they'll mix in like again the corner maybe, but other than that, they're probably not going to be in any other play out of this formation. So I'm gonna go over HB wheel first. Um. So what what we want to do is again, all right. So we're gonna set up our blitz right like normal we're not going to do the compressed set and i'll tell you guys why in a minute so we know because this has been a popular play for now years right oh make sure we're, we contain this has been a popular play for years right so we know the routes that are coming so what we're going to do is we're going to man up that safety on his we're going to cross man him on his zero because when he comes across he's going to be boxed right that's that's their first read really out of this formation now their second read honestly is the flat they want that tight end or the running back on that little table route and because we're sending the blitz they're going to feel the pressure so they're like oh okay flat route picked off easy um so because we're pressed that corner route that deep blue should take care of the corner route and if not gg to them um just also know you're down in distance but the heat should come in by the time uh he's even able to throw the corner out um so the other thing you want to do is you want to man up the running back because he's on that wheel route right now i would come out in the blitz first don't do any adjustments maybe cross man but if i wouldn't man up that guy just yet but even then like unless they're on pa slide and they streaked him or fade him you're good and if you see it just go user don't you don't want to give up the touchdown but we, we should be good right but let, let's say we know what's coming so you want to man him up he's going to take care of the wheel now the only thing that you need to cover is the in route or they they sometimes slant him but you see like they're either going to run into each other or whatever it is and you're going to have enough time to, to get over there so again this is the the setup for HB wheel. Oh, make sure you have the flat. So that this is the setup. Nothing, nothing else to it. It boxes up because you're gonna see that he's gonna take. And we're alright. So we're using the in route. That's one route covered. We're using the in route. I'm gonna show you guys on the replay. We use the in route. We cross man Fitzgerald. If I finally move too, yeah, I started moving. So come on. So Fitzgerald's manned up, the running back's manned up, the flats are right there. Again, only leaving the corner out, right? Only leaving the corner out. And again, they bumped each other too, making it easier. But as you guys will see, that blitz is already there. The blitz is already there, so it doesn't even matter. By the time the corner out is going to get open, because it's, it's a pretty decent corner out. Because even then, so as soon as he broke, right, right there... He would have to throw it 
But one, he's running backwards because the blitz is coming. And by the time he would have probably thrown it, he's like, yo, I'm it's over. GG, I'm getting sacked. So that that's the setup for HB Wheel. Uh, what I like to do, because and you'll you'll see their pattern or you'll you'll know the down and distance. Maybe I'll come out and hold on new play. Um my my typical run defense for everything is cover four. So I'm gonna show you guys that right now. My setup for cover four. Um I want to do this really quickly for you guys too, because this might might take long. Uh base line, pinch line, crash out, uh shade down just in case you know they want to hit flats. Bring both safeties down, and because I know it's power, I'm gonna move this linebacker over a little bit and I'm I'm gonna cheat over. So he's gonna run the play. And we want to try and hit hit a gap. Hit a gap. And but he's so so he cut back in. Normally I would probably click on and it's GG. So I'm gonna set that up again for you guys. And honestly, nobody's gonna uh, cut in. CPU wanna be great. So again, by by moving guys into the box, by moving those safeties into the box, it's making the linemen have to say, okay, we we might have to pick these guys up. And because we know it's power, we wanna move him over a little bit. And we're gonna stay over here and try try and hit a gap one time. Boom. See, we blew it up. But they're probably gonna want to kick it to the outside. Nine times out of ten, they're not they're not gonna cut in like that, like how, how they're doing. So again, move them out, boom, boom, call it. Call it. Boom. We're there. Box. Alright. So that's our power old defense. Uh we're gonna head back into the blitz. And I'm gonna show you guys how to lock up PA slide. Now, because this is a play action, this is a different, little different of a setup and a little bit more um, to it. Uh, this, so, this is something I found, you know, just playing around, messing around. And this could even be like an actual setup. You could just mix it in. So, because people like to hit the flats, right? Uh, on this play, they like to hit either, either side. Um, but because we're sending the flat on this side, that that tight end is going to get open on the play action okay so let me just remember my my routes okay cool so boom 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 set up our blitz okay so this is our blitz right oh uh, nope contain okay so this is our blitz so we want to shade down right because it's going to take care of the running back um and then we have the brown and brown coming across the middle right so and then he's on an out route some people may streak him they may even slam them. I don't know. But mostly it's either a streak or they're going to keep them on the out route. Now, what I'm going to do, this call me crazy. Call me crazy, though. But you want to have things covered, right? You're going to put him in a hard flat. You're going to read deep blue him. And you're going to read deep blue him. And you just want to cover the middle. If they hit the out route, GG. Um, but because the blitz is going to get in, it's not going to matter. So we're going to call the play right here. Come on. Boom. Both flats cover. Okay. See. All right. So it's covered. Good. GG. No yards or very little yards. We can get. He's in the backfield. He's in the backfield. So I just want to put another deep blue out there. And maybe if you got 91 zone, um, you should be good. Nothing really should. And, and you have another deep blue over there. So he should, he should react if there's anything up the seam or whatever. Um, or if you see HB wheel, just your first priority, if you're in this setup, cover, cover this deep post, cover the deep post. If he throws the in route, cool. If he throws the out route, whatever, you just don't want to get beat because that, that, uh, post route might beat this setup. So you, you want to cover that. We're going to call. Boom. No yards, one yard. Who cares? Boom. So that's the setup for those plays, the more popular plays. The more pop. Oh, geez. All right. So that's the that's the setup for more, most of the popular plays. Out of split close. Uh. So okay, why I don't understand why he just wants to stop and not come in, but whatever. That's on him. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it helped because Split Close is a, a really 
popular formation. And it's tough if you don't know how to stop the basic plays out of it. Um, but this is the end of this video, guys. And again, if you guys didn't check out uh, AKG's video, please go do so now. That's a very, really good play. I tend to use it sometimes in, in tough spots when I need a first down or I, I, need, I need a lot of yards. That's something I go to. So please definitely check that out uh, for me. Hit that like button over here and over there and over here. Hit that sub if you haven't already. And until next time, guys, peace out.